want to thank each of the witnesses for being here as well today. Uh, this is an issue that uh, the chairman and I and many up here are deeply concerned about. In fact, we just had a productive debate on this issue on the floor uh, this week, and we are concerned about the future of the Merit Systems Protection Board. And uh, I know, Chairman, you know that I am uh, very committed to ensuring that we have a successful operation at MSPB. In fact, during the 115th Congress, the Oversight Committee conducted numerous hearings and even passed the MSPB reauthorization bill, which would have made some critical reforms uh, to MSPB. And the responsibilities there uh, primarily uh, include to adjudicate appeals of Federal personnel uh, actions and to also uh, to provide protection for whistleblowers. And Congress has a duty, I believe, to ensure that MSPB functions effectively and administers their rulings fairly. To be effective uh, and to be able to make uh, decisions properly, MSPB needs at least two members uh, to make a quorum, and as we are all aware of today, that has not been the case now for two years. And without a quorum, the backlog has gotten quite dramatic of now nearly 2,000 cases, uh, and that is um, very disturbing. The only remaining member, again, as the Chairman uh, highlighted a moment ago, Mark Robbins, is term limited. And we want to welcome you and thank you for your service and for being here today. Um, but starting tomorrow, MSPB will be without a single board member. Currently, there are two uh, MSPB nominees awaiting consideration in the Senate. And looking ahead, I hope the President will go ahead and nominate the third board member. And as we were talking about a few moments ago, we desperately need the Senate to quickly confirm these nominations, uh, and we need the third one as quickly as possible. Uh, in December, the President asked Mr. Robbins to serve as the General Counsel at the Office of Personnel Management. And over the past 10 weeks, he has been serving in both roles at OPM and MSPB. And uh, Mr. Robbins, you have worked tirelessly, uh, and we deeply appreciate the work that you have, have given. But we know that it is time that you are now moving on. Um, but your sense of duty to the MSPB is greatly appreciated, and we do want to express that publicly to you. Your commitment to Federal workers and the Federal workforce is greatly appreciated. Uh, and your willingness now to serve the President and our country in another capacity also is appreciated. But in closing, I hope that we can work together to provide certainty to Federal workers and whistleblowers by making the MSPB operational once again. Uh, and again, Chairman, I thank you. I yield back.